am going to do this in English because uh, this has probably not been done before what we are trying today and so this could really be a world first and what I'm tr going to do is to try and ring two teraflops of DP performance out of a single card. What we have here is one of NVIDIA's brand new toys, the GeForce GTX Titan. And we have the OpenCL Compute Benchmark from HPC Tech, which is a synthetic benchmark. And it has a nice function for double ops. And it's a very short benchmark, probably not very practical, but it should give us a start. So what we're seeing here is, in standard mode, we're getting 220 gigaflops. That's, uh, well, not very much actually, but Nvidia has been so kind to have a driver panel option in order to use maximum speed double precision. And we're going to enable that now. Run the test. This is much better. This is almost 1.4 teraflops of double precision, which is pretty much high above the CPU. It's about 14 times, uh, 28 times as much. And what you haven't seen yet is that while running this benchmark, I'm going to rerun it. The boost function of the card is disabled. Only while updating the display, it goes to 849 megahertz. And this is why NVIDIA has uh, used the separate DP ALUs. And fortunately, they did not disable overclocking and so we are going to try to get the maximum out of this card right now. We can do the voltage tweak, giving the card a maximum over voltage of 1.2 volts up from 1.16. Unlinking power and 10 target, prioritizing 10 target and now we are trying this again without overclocking right now. Okay, it's already a little bit more and now we're going to overclock it. Since the base clock is very low actually, we're going to start with 100 megahertz much more. We need to rerun this test a little because the clock does not stay at the higher value. So we need to catch a moment where it's actually already overclocked to start the test. So it's at 1.6 gigahertz right now. We're going to 200 megahertz more. Starting the test. Restarting the test as I've said before. So we're at almost one gigahertz now, more than one gigahertz actually. And at 1.8 teraflops. Okay, we're giving it a little bit more, 300 megahertz plus. And rerunning the test again. Eleven seventy five megahertz. And we're at one point nine teraflops DP. So obviously we need it a little bit more. And 
and running the test again. So the boost is at one. 1.24 gigahertz and that's almost 1.9 teraflops right now oh there we go we did it that's one teraflops of dp add one teraflops of dp multiply and two teraflops out of a single gpu of double precision performance even though it's just a short synthetic benchmark and it's probably not stable for long periods of time but this is really amazing so with a clock rate of 1.24 gigahertz we've achieved really over two teraflops of double precision out of a GeForce GTX Titan this is just amazing so thank you for watching and maybe you want to add our channel to your favorites or something like that, just click on the button, you know where it is.